Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So I don't know if you guys have heard, I might have mentioned it once or twice, no big deal, but um, I got played on BBC Radio 2 last week. What the hell? I just wanted to like basically tell you how this came about. It's pretty much been the best thing that's happened in my career so far. And uh, that is all down to one man, my hero. Jeremy Vine. So basically, um, a few weeks ago I went busking. So if you don't know, um, I'm a full-time musician and most of that comes from busking uh, in London. I had this slot at Charing Cross and I almost, I swear to God, I almost didn't go to it. I was supposed to busk four till six. I actually ended up not getting there till half five. Half an hour's busking is pretty pointless, but something, I don't know, I don't know if it's fate, but something told me that I should go. It was a Friday evening. I was just in a really good mood and I think that kind of came across and everyone was seeing very nice to me and I checked my phone like two hours later and I saw on Twitter that I had like loads of notifications so I clicked on it and basically Jeremy Vine, Channel 5 slash Radio 2's Jeremy Vine saw me busking and he tweeted basically saying I've just seen this amazing busker in Charing Cross Station um, I have to know who she is, can't remember the name, but it had Walker in it. And all of these people, I don't even know, I don't think I know them, so they must have like Googled Busker Walker or something and uh, started tagging me like, this must be Lucy May Walker. He then responded saying, yes, it was you, amazing. But it was crazy, like I got so many followers from that. I think normal people, <laughs> I say normal, I don't know. A lot of people might have that happen to them and be like, oh my God, that was so cool. Um, not this guy. So basically, I slid into Jeremy Vine's DMs on Twitter. If you don't know what that means, it basically just sent him a private message. I feel like it is so hard to make it, whatever that means these days in the music industry, that when you get these opportunities, they don't come around very often. So for me personally, I like to grab them by the you know. So yeah, sent him my music and he then forwarded that to his like sound guy and then a few days later he played Heartbreak Song on his BBC Radio 2 show. I cannot tell you how big this is. Like there's so many artists that are on like signed to labels. They pay like, radio pluggers to, to get on the radio and even then they, they might not get a play on anything and because of busking and just being at the right place, right time, I got played on radio too. I was so excited, like, oh my God. I got about like 500 new followers from this. It was mental. Everyone showed so much like support and telling Jeremy like, this is so like good of you. It might've been a little thing for him to do, but the impact what it's having on me is like crazy like I I sold I know again this shows how not big of an artist I am but I sold 15 CDs on my website that day my Spotify streams just went up and it was just crazy again most people might just be like wow that amazing thing happened basically I sent him another message just to say thank you and people on Twitter have been really really positive and I just thought you might be interested in a little interview or something a few emails later and um, Jeremy Vine and his team at Radio 2 invited me in to do a live session. Oh my god. <laughs> ah. I am going to be performing two songs live and doing an interview on um, Wednesday the 31st of October, which is Halloween, so you can't forget that, at half one uh, in the afternoon. If you are listening live, I'm going to be talking um, about some things that are happening at the moment. I'm also going to be announcing another very exciting thing. If, if you missed the show, you can listen back on iPlayer. And yeah, just massive, massive thank you to Jeremy Vine for playing my songs. And if any other radio presenters of Radio 2 or 1 or 4 or 6 are listening, like, give me a call. Thank you so much for watching this video. And um, thank you for like keeping up to date and, and watching my, my journey. Fingers crossed um, this is going to lead on to big, big things. And um, thanks for being there while it hasn't been so big. I don't know what I'm saying. Uh, if you like this video, um, please give me a little subscribe. Let me know if you're going to listen to the show. I've been Lucy May Walker. Goodbye. 
Okay, so I, so I got, uh, let's start again.